Hi folks, today we're out here with the Hatfield uh, 410. This is a single shot gun sold at Walmart for $99. Uh, gonna try to give it a little workout. This will be the second time out shooting it. Uh, first time it worked fine. Uh, today we're gonna do some double lot buck through it. And what these are, they're hand loaded stuff and there's four pellets per shell. And then we're also gonna do some Double A size eights, add some clay pigeons, and then finish up with some Remington game loads, uh, uh, three inch at some uh, blocks of wood. But uh, this video is going to cut out and come back, and then be a full rest of the way through. I had a little problem; didn't have my camera going the first time I shot this. So let's go ahead and uh, get you on target. Uh, we're shooting a silhouette type target and as I say we're using the double out buck and we're going to shoot five of them at it. So we got a possibility of, of 20 pellets hidden. We're going to shoot center mass. We'll see what this, this thing will do. As you can see, that's our pretty, uh, pretty uh, large pattern. I did uh, deviate from left to right a little bit, but uh, you can see that what kind of damage that would do. That would be uh, that's a 30 caliber size bullet. That's a 308 diameter size bullet hitting somebody. Uh, these are going about 1,400 feet per second. So let's go ahead and uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this here, and let's go ahead and start with the rest of the. Uh, of the other video. Okay, as you can see, it did this is fine. Let's go ahead and we're gonna do some uh, some of the little uh, two and a half inches. And we're gonna be shooting at some uh, clay pigeons. And then for the last two, I'm gonna come back and shoot a couple of the buckshot at some pieces of wood there. So let's go ahead and see how this goes. Yeah, this is about 15 yards, so. Keep on having a problem pulling the hammer back.
Okay, I knocked over one of my pieces of wood, so I'm going to go out there and reset it real quick. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and use the uh, double lot buck. These are only four pellets, so hopefully we can hit our target. Yeah, that, that looked all right. Knocked the heck out of that one. See if we can do this other one. That, that's pretty impressive. It knocked the heck out of those wood blocks. So, let's go ahead and shoot these last uh, blocks. I've got to move my camera real quick. Let me go ahead and uh, get that moved. And you know what, instead of, uh, I'm going to use like uh, three of them, I'm going to use this, these number, these uh, three inch on. The last two, man, I loved how much it busted up that wood over there. So I'm going to use uh, the, the double off buckshot at uh, the last two. But we're going to go ahead and start from uh, right to left. Okay, on these last two, let's say I'm gonna have to go back to that dumb body. It blew the heck out of that other wood. That's what it is. Best. that load that is pretty awesome I uh, I wouldn't expect it to be that powerful and to do that much damage to that wood uh, as I say this is my first time out here with it with that particular load well as you can see the gun held up pretty good uh, you know for a home defense gun it's only a single shot gun but man if you just had one intruder and in those double uh, buckshot loads <laughs> I don't think he'd come back again well, I appreciate y'all watching. Uh, if you got anything else you'd like to see this gun do or any more questions about it, just let me know. Uh, as I say, it's just a little single shot. Pull back the trigger each time. I do have a bad problem with pulling back the trigger instead of ejecting my shell. And as you can see, this is how the shells eject. It just kind of comes up. You just pull it out with your fingers. But... Uh, other than that, it's a nice, easy little gun to operate. Lots of fun. Not too hard on the shoulder because it's 410. Well, thanks again for watching, and have a wonderful day.